Okay. Anyway, this episode is uh, brought to you by Chemicor. Oof, ouch, owie, cavities, and wisdom teeth hurt. Why bother with a lifetime of dental nightmares when you can bite back against them? Chemicor's tooth haste speeds up the natural tooth decay process, allowing you to pluck out those corrosive choppers with ease. Tooth haste. No tooth, no oof. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <laughs> Emails to the Roblox. <laughs> anyway, welcome back to the fucking show. Uh, Buy dice. This is a blood little messaging. <laughs> or not to support. It's right super right. liminal. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the ad in the corner. <laughs> click it. Click it. Oh, it doesn't click. It's not a click it link. Click. You can click it, but you'll just pause Scroll the Scroll down and click below. Learn to uh, type. You fucks. <laughs> Learn to type. Click that X Learn that to type doesn't cobalt. actually That's when we get a right. letter from right. Libra right. Arcana. Like, Let's round this back up here. you just call our customers fucks? Why, <laughs> why would you do this? Dude. Well, they're not your customers yet. <laughs> exactly. We're calling fucks no. to turn them into your the, customers. The they're Libras, not your customers. They're our viewers. The Libras Arcana people are really... They have a good sense of humor to them. Yeah, they're So they, they've they put up uh, with a lot of the stupid shit that I have said and tagged them in and done to them mm-hmm. on Twitter. So they're, they're uh, along. Tyler says he's here. Oh, he is. Ding dong. The, the doorbell just rang. So you go get Tyler and I'll keep talking. Right. Yeah, uh, I already said my ad, which shit. sucks because this is a good place He's getting where Tyler. I can say it. He's first up in initiative order. You mm. should say the full Libra Sarcana ad now. Oh uh, yeah, the one which I have clearly written down. Um, Somewhere. I can do it. Okay. <laughs> of all the things I've written down, an actual ad for them. Right. Do you need more dice? Yes. Do you hate going to the store? Yeah. God, yes. Depends. Do you hate having to sort through the stacks and stacks of dice they have at the store, looking for the set that's just perfect, but your natural anxiety into it and, and aversion to decision making? keeps you from picking a set out they don't yeah, even let me touch one of my the favorite parts holes. of the purchasing pro- I, I mean no shut up <laughs> <laughs> well worry no more over there okay head yeah. over to librasarcana.com <laughs> sign up for their monthly or quarterly subscription service they'll send you fantastic dice on a get this monthly or quarterly schedule beautiful dice well crafted Mm-hmm. And nobody will tell you you can't touch them. At the you can touch those dice as much as you, you fucking get your want. Your right around them. Suckers. You want Hell, pizza. you could even put them in your rectum if you want. We have pizza. Just, I saw pizza. Or in your just mouth. Then you get it. Before. Or in your mouth. That's, yeah. Why would you put them in your rectum? Like that seems unpleasant. There's another one of these green chairs behind the curtains. Anyway. Also rectum. I hardly even knew him. Oh man. <laughs> get your get your bag off the table. Okay. LibrasArcana.com. Discount code COBALD on your subscription service will get you 20% off your first month's purchase. Yay! So do that fucking shit or you'll make Else. Joe cry. Yeah. What? Again. 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 You dicks. Uh, we're missing Dan though. Uh, Tyler, roll initiative. That's a third oh, tier of Patreon. What's an initiative? A D10 <laughs> plus your initiative. Into a jar. Oh, God. Yeah. Where's a D10? Seven. Is that a seven? Yes. Currently, the situation is uh, he's taking his clothes off. Oh, he's doing a dance. That sounds like uh, my. Well, he party. did a he did a cartwheel and then he took his pants off. Yeah. The idea was I was going to be funny and distract them. Yeah. Um, and then the rest of us still. Fifteen. Damn. And Joe failed. Oh. It's the story of bravery agility? that will never be told accurately. Agility. Forty-four. <laughs> it's a plus five though. Well, you... Would you... Damn. <laughs> you rolled a fifteen, right? I rolled a seven plus my agility, which was an eight. Or I my rolled an eight initiative. plus a seven. Are, are you stealthing? Is what I'm asking. Oh, what's the roll for a stealth? No, uh, we're stealth. past that. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, no, go ahead and roll stealth. Hmm. Okay. Is it a? Ten plus my agility? no, it's it's just a stealth skill check. Uh, at deep. this moment, roll your per- I say roll your percentage first. Okay, roll your percentage. Yeah, this was a. We could probably just tell you right off the percentage roll. Flowing. 
It's a 61, which I think is way over yeah. whatever my stealth is. What's your stealth or your agility score? Uh, it was 40 something. So 44, yeah. yeah. So yeah, it's way over. Do you have? Hang on. You. This is. I don't have any check, points in stealth. So no. it's a 54. So okay. Yeah, you still lose. Yeah. <laughs> I suck. You have Man. lost. Combat starts. Okay. Sorry. You Russell see the to come down here and, and play with us. Oh yeah. Sadly no. Uh, you see Jake's character trying to distract the orc and the goblins, and it doesn't work. Valiant effort. You hear Joe's jailer alert one of the goblins, and the goblin looks back and stares right at Joe's location. Not so valiant effort. Yeah, I'm disappointed. Like swinging my key rein around. Like that. It's your turn. <laughs> the goblin and the orc don't know where you're at. Okay, well, I think the first one that we probably want to get to, if it's only the goblin that noticed where Joe is. Yeah. Uh, well, that's incorrect now. Now Tyler's also been noticed. Yes. By the same goblin or by more people? As I come stumbling uh, in from behind everybody you know, else, trip over my own By feet. everybody? We'll, we'll say by the other goblin. By yeah. everybody. Well, at ah, this point, ah, I think ah. the orc is some more dangerous enemy, so I'll just shoot at the orc, I guess. Was your crossbow loaded? Yeah, I mean, okay. that's what I said before we even started the thing. I was going to load my crossbow. So Make your attack roll. Um, now, I remember you talking about a thing that I can do. Aiming? Uh -huh. huh? Aiming? Yes, yeah, so you can use aim. How Are you using aim at one action point or two? Um, gosh, it's on the cheat sheet. Do you have any copies of the cheat sheets? I got copies of the cheat sheet. So you're going to... I also have a copy of my printer information for some reason. Take that, aim. That's really helpful for the yeah. game. Take aim. Spend one action point to gain a plus 10 base chance to your next attack action or perilous stunt. If you spend two action points, you gain a 20 or plus 20 base chance instead. You cannot take aim to cast magic. So we're going to call this a routine attack for you. So if you want to spend one action point to take aim... You treat your score as 10 higher. If you want to spend two, you treat it as 20 higher. And then I got to remember. It's really different. What's your. Uh, uh, How much it costs me to attack? What's your combat score? You're uh, just pulling the trigger as 1 AP. It's 48. So. so 48. It's 1 AP to attack, but then you won't be able to reload. I might as well do 2, two AP. On okay. Phone. So 48. Do you I have do any skills in martial hard. range? I, I do, but since you we've moved down on peril, you ignore yeah, it. Yeah. So you're going to treat your score as 68. So you now need to roll under 68. Watch me fudge it up, anyways. I'm at it. Same with the dice towers. But you would flop it. Uh, 15. You strike this orc in the back. You said you dealt. Oh, you hit. You roll your damage. <laughs> it's a d6. D6. That's right. Plus it's your. I, I've not attacked anybody yet <laughs> successfully. Oh, so just a d6. Hey, uh, it'll be. I think it's just a d6 as long as your crossbow doesn't have any special abilities. And if it lands on a six, you keep rolling. My crossbow has two things. Qualities. What are those qualities? On the second page of the cheat sheet, it has the qualities. Oh shit. What are your weapon qualities? I'm so not prepared for this. Uh, I think it's fast. Fast. Whenever a foe is struck, they get a negative 10 to their dodge or parry. Uh, this orc is unaware, so it's not going to get any chance to dodge or parry. It's probably weak, right? No, it shouldn't be. What's the next one? Is it punishing? Um, I wish I had written it all out instead of just writing a letter, because there was only one P on the quality section for ranged weapons, but on here we have all of them. Uh... Oh, there's powerful, pummeling, punishing. I think it's powerful, but it could be punishing because it's. Let me just see. If you want to like, which one sounds right? The most powerful of the three. Well, you're yeah. using a crossbow. I think an I arbalist crossbow. Yeah, I thought I wrote. Two Bless you. Two. I would just go for powerful for now, and then. Arbalist crossbow, fast punishing. Punishing. Okay. That's cool looking. So, you punishing. So Immediately yeah. after striking a foe with this weapon, you had a d6 fury die. Uh, 
Yes, or you could spend an additional one action point. <laughs> so of course it was. Oh, no. I think that's I'm the name of every Etsy shop. It doesn't do anything right now. You could have spent an extra action point to add another D6. Roll a D6, add your CB. What did you roll? Uh, one. Add your CB. Which is six. Okay. You deal six damage to the orc. I'm going to write this out. Again. Tyler, it's your yeah. turn. Oh. There's an orc staring at a cabin that's on fire. Well, now staring at Jake's character with his pants down. And then there's two goblins looking back in the woods where you and the rest of the group are hiding. Or there were. I had enough copies for um, everybody. Where yeah. are the cheat sheets? Oh, they're right here. Oh, okay, there we I go. I assume we're a little ways away from these goblins and orcs. Yeah, we'll give it uh, 25 feet. Um, or however many yards that would be. Six yards. No, that's not right. Eight yards. I don't know for sure that that's right. Uh, I assume our movement speed is our is yards, right? Yes. So I'm going to hustle at movement X1. So I'm going to move eight yards towards one of these goblin fellows. Okay. And then I'm going to make a... Do you... What weapon do you have? Uh, uh, I do not know. I've never used them yet. I have a threshing flail and a shiv. I'm going to use my threshing flail because that seems less okay. shitty than a shiv. Roll a... Uh, it's simple melee. Yeah, simple. I was gonna ask about perilous stunts. Are those after the attack succeeds, or no? You could do it before. Uh, I'm just gonna do the attack for right now since I don't know what I'm doing yet. Okay, so you've used one action point to move over, and then I'm gonna use one action point to attack. <clears throat> this is gonna be well, a simple the, melee. Your uh, threshing mail. It's a threshing simple melee. Threshing flail right, is uh, also the, the simple melee. Encounter yeah, value is it? two. Yeah. yeah, encumbrance. That's encumbrance. Two. Oh, it weighs two pounds. So whatever. roll your attack, What's Tyler. Value? I don't know what its encounter value is. Uh, don't worry about that, guys. Just roll your attack, Tyler. Uh, that is a fourteen. Uh, fourteen is going to hit despite any difficulty because my combat bonus is forty-three. So yeah. Okay. So you strike at one of the goblins. Now you need to roll damage. Does the threshing mail? What abilities? It's, Versatile and weak. So versatile you, means it can be one or two handed. Right. If you do versatile two handed, you get to add one damage. I'm gonna. I'm doing two handed because I don't have anything else. All right. So roll a d6. Offhand. Roll your. Add your CB. That's a six. Oh, that explodes. Roll it again. That's another six. Roll it again. Three. That's a four. Okay. So that is what is that right there? Sixteen. Sixteen, 16 plus one plus your 17, CB. Twenty. Jesus. Uh, you fuck a guy up. <laughs> Move <Straight> apparently <laughs> all the way up. But I Bloody believe Christ, weak means that it can't kill him. Yeah, or no. it can't do a certain type of wound. I don't know. Can only inflict moderate or serious injuries, never grievous injuries. But you move this goblin from unharmed to fucking Su dead, super harmed. Wait. And that means just you can still move them past that threshold. You just can't Actually do that type it. of yep. injury. Yeah. Well, we'll still roll it. You would do a lesser injury. Right. Yeah. I can still kill them if I roll enough numbers, but... They are on grievously wounded, one step away from slain. Is this on the orc? Or this is on one of the goblins. I just goblins. took one of the goblins. So yeah. you need to roll me 3d6. Three more d6s? Um, yeah. Here. Thank you, sir. Uh, two threes and a six. Uh, that six, you inflict a wound on this goblin. Okay. I'm going to have to keep using your dice. They're pretty good. Uh, no kidding. You inflict a death wound. <laughs> is, yeah, is the I wound called death? <laughs> definitely. Oh my gosh. I'm in the wrong fucking section of this PDF. That's why I can't find it. The wound is called. Dirt. Roll me a percentile, I think. Give me just a second on that. Where the hell is my? Oh, there it is. There it goes. This ailment is called dead. <laughs> <laughs> What's the status right. of the malady? You said roll. One of them. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna call this a serious injury. Roll me a percentile. 
66. Yeah, 66. You fracture this goblin's skull. Uh, until fully recuperated, it must flip all skill test results to fail. Oh, so you nice. crack this goblin's skull open. Blood spilling out. You see a bit of bone. Jake, it's your turn. <laughs> He's operating at the uh, Did you have any AP left? Time. I have one AP. I'll, I'll just save it to <laughs> okay. uh, parry or whatever later. Okay. You always uh, have three, right? You have three. You'll start with three. Okay. Is the orc still looking at me? Yeah. <laughs> uh, in that case, I look at the orc and say, Ta-da! Is the orc amused or confused? It's pink. It actually has pink lead in it. Yeah, I'm wondering what that would count as, too. <laughs> so you do your little ta-da. Are you doing that ta-da to inspire your comrades in this combat, or are you doing it to try and intimidate the orc? I'm doing it to keep the orc focused on me, while his buddy's head just explode. <laughs> Go ahead and make an intimidate check. An intimidate check? That's a strange... Because I'm going to count it, you're doing a litany of hatred. You don't have to if you want to. If you want to save all three of your AP. That's a really fancy way to say helicopter. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. Uh, let's see. Uh, where is my activity? Oh. Wrong. Damn, boy, is that? The fact that you're brave enough to get out there in a helicopter in front of us could be intimidating. That is a pass. Yeah. All right. Because, all right, guys, because the litany of hatred succeeds... <laughs> The orc's damage and peril threshold is reduced by one. Ooh. So he's easier to hurt. He feels emasculated. Because you're across the him. board, like all four. Two yep. Not bad for a gnome. <laughs> yep. <laughs> no, uh, it no, is... no way they call me the one eyed bastard. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, it is God. the orc's turn, though, Jake. And this orc moves up to you. And it attacks you with its big, crude axe. Hopefully he's not calling his shot very hard. <laughs> Take aim. No! Uh, the the orc, no bastard. The orc's attack connects. Oh, no. Uh, do you have any AP left? You can try to only parry thing, or... So yeah. I guess just parry. No, I, I don't have any AP left. Lindy of Hatred was only one AP. Oh, really? Yes. Oh, then hell yeah, I'm parrying. You got a oh, weapon yeah. out? Here's the... Yep, I got my pointed stick, as always. <laughs> okay. That's another word for it. <laughs> so, go ahead and make me Just that... Just slap it right out of the way. <laughs> make me that parry check. <sighs> Talk about sword fighting. Yeah, really. Parry is a... It's your weapon. Combat, okay. Yeah. No. Okay. Uh, Baker's making a raid. Nine damage. Woof. Does that move you down? What? One bits. I really don't like this three page setup after playing with that two page. Setup. Hey, Sergeant Baker, he's my bestie. Thanks for that bit, Chief. Yeah, that brought me down the damage threshold there. Uh, you moved to lightly wounded? Is there a bottle opener yep. somewhere? Yeah, I got one. Oh, thank you. So. Okay. Lightly wounded. Uh, after that, the the orc used an action point to move up to you. The orc used an action point to attack you, and the orc's going to bank its last action point. Moving the turn to Joe. Uh, One of the goblins has had its skull cracked in, but still up. The other goblin is just standing there, and the other orc just attacked Jake's character with a big old gnarly axe. Um. Uh, tactical me wants to kill Goblin, but do it. Rational character would want to help friend, so probably just gonna charge. Also, I'm not your friend. The well, which one? You're not being threatened. Yeah, by, yeah. by, by, by the brain Goblin. By the brain Goblin. Fair yeah. enough. Yes. <laughs> you fucked him up. Anyway, so, so what's I'm, going on, Joe? Uh, I'm going to do a charge on the orc. 
Okay. The, the, does the orc look damaged? <clears throat> I. From... The orc is not does not look damaged. From... Jake, did you do? You didn't attack. I, I shot him. You shot him the arrow, but I don't think it was probably enough to do anything. It was not enough to do anything. Okay. That's fine. Um, so yeah, the orc is still unharmed. Bastard. I'm gonna go so charge two AP. Piece. You move two yeah. times your movement. And you get to add an extra D six for damage. Yep. Yeah. So you're gonna run up and then attack the orc. Yep. Two handed and rushing ball. All right. Roll that shit out. What's fast? Uh, it means that if they try to parry your dodge, they get a negative ten to their chance ah, to do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, which he should have that because I hit him with fast weapon. Only against that weapon though. So when you attack, oh, if he tries to I dodge attack. it, okay. Yeah, it doesn't give that to him forever. It's okay. just oh, that should be like a round of combat yeah. or something like that. Yeah. Okay. Just when you're attacking with it, it's so it's, that that makes a lot more sense than the stupid thing I just said. So you should have rolled two d six. Oh, excuse me. And add your CB. Okay, two d six. That's what have I got? Yeah, since you charged, you get that extra d six. And then I'm two in the... So that'll be a plus I mean, one as well. So 2d6 plus yeah, one plus your CV. Oh, plus... Okay, okay. Yeah. But you can still miss. Right. One in the two. Well. All right, so that's yeah, going to be three your plus yeah. your one. That's four. Okay. What's your CV? My CV is four. So, so you deal eight. eight. You move this sure thing this from unharmed it, to lightly wounded. All right. Well, we never know. You said you did... Is it making an attack part of... Does that cost an action point, or do I have one free? Is that part of my charge, or is uh, No, you still have to make your attack roll after that. Three bullets, it's not bad. That counts as an action point? Yep. Okay, so I don't have any left. No, you're all spent. Okay. Uh, yeah, Adam, thanks for coming by, and I am excited to see you on Friday. Hell yeah. Uh, Joe, after Joe, goes Chris. Chris. Um... My whole turn is going to be spent in the dark reloading. It takes okay. him 3 AP to load his. Okay. Yeah. okay you do your load. Uh, the goblin that had its mm -hmm. head cracked in by you, it. Tyler, mm -hmm. is going to make an attack at you very poorly. Uh, I'm going to dodge or whatever parry. Is it parry? Well, well you got to see if the attack connects oh, okay. first. Okay. Uh, which it does not. Okay. Because uh, its brain is a little bit exposed. <laughs> I know. Uh, next week, it's going to be great. Uh, and then that goblin is going to... Next week. Next week's going to be great. Go ahead and bank a point. Uh, the next goblin, however, has not had its head cracked open. And it runs over to you, Tyler. Oh, mm -hmm. okay. They all want to be dodgy boys. Mm -hmm. uh, and it just completely whips. It doesn't get even close to hitting with you. Or hitting you. Uh, Alex. All right. So my social class is burger or whatever it is. Yeah. Burger. So they're a different social class than me. They would then. count as like low class. Yeah. All right. Burger. And so that would technically. What ability are you using? I have the forked tongue. That gives a 20 plus based on my guile test, correct? Yes, it does. So I want to, if I think correctly, I can use that for dirty tricks then. Is dirty tricks a guile test? Mm -hmm. Yep. Make a guile test. You are absolutely correct. All right, so I'm going to hustle over there. Oh, there you go. Uh, and then grab some pocket sand. Oh, that's beautiful. <laughs> Who are you pocket sanding? Uh, who's the most like aggressive looking right now? The orc. Yeah. The orc, yeah. So yeah. I'm going to run up to him, tap him on the shoulder, like, hey, guy, uh, take a look at this. Okay. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. That's Check a 37. This yeah. Okay. Uh, the orc is going to try and resist that. Uh, so it's going to make an awareness check. Uh, now, since you had that plus 20, it means the orc has a negative 20. Hell yeah. Nice. Jeez. So it would normally have to roll 55. So now it has to roll under 35. Uh, and it does not. That hell yeah. Speed. So the orc is now blinded. Did you say Shasha as you threw the pocket sand in his eyes? <laughs> what does that do mechanically? Uh, he can't dodge or much. parry or counter spell. Yep. Oh, so, nice. 
do the you hustle. Just got to stand there and take it. Yep. So. I don't know if their turn is directly after me. Uh, so after like, you, it moves to me. Dan, Tyler, and Jake. Oh hell yeah! Okay, that's good. I right. did. I did the right. You did the right thing. I still and have it, one AP correct. Yep, you can bank it, but you save. Wait, it for he a hustled. Dodge. Oh, hustles, hustles one. That's right. It yeah, sounds right. like it's faster than. Yeah, one. I'm gonna bank that. All right, Dan, your turn. Uh, I actually have the ability as long as I pass a coordination test to reload quickly. To reload for free. All right, make the coordination test. Uh, which. I'm not. Okay, so reloading is going to cost you two AP. <laughs> yep, I rolled a fifty-two. Okay, <laughs> I needed a fifty. Are you oh. going to go ahead and attack this hey, turn? Um, we we got some. Yeah, Dan. Yep. Hmm? Points. So, some points over there. Is it worth it to spend on reloading it's for if free? If you think it's worth it, I can still what shoot kind of this points? turn. Okay, there you go then. Okay. What are we... Fortune points. So you can use a fortune oh. point to re-roll an attack. Mm. Or you can use a fortune point to treat a d6 rolled on damage as a 6, getting you an auto-explode. Interesting. Just, just for the interest of we've got just five of them left. Don't uh, worry, I'll waste them for you guys. Yeah. But, uh, I wasn't going to use it. Oh. Sorry. I, I, I was, I was Your, your preamble it. made it sound like you were going to use it. <laughs> no, I, I want to bank them because we only have five of them left. So like I said, I'll waste them better. I think our heart stuff's Excuse coming you. up later. Maybe. All right, roll your attacks. It's like those health points. Those health portions. Uh, 26. Save it for later. Is that, is that a success? <laughs> yeah. That's like all right. Wheels. And the, <laughs> uh, the orc here is unable if you're crawling because you're carrying to make any wings. kind of dodge. <laughs> yep. So, roll your damage. So, the only thing that Seven. armor does is like reduce damage then? Say what? So, armor just reduces damage then? Well, armor it, increases, increases your, your damage threshold. threshold. Your threshold, okay. Yeah. And if it rolls under your threshold, then it's like you're not hit at all. Yeah. Which is probably what I just did again. Uh, you knock the orc down from lightly wounded to moderately wounded, which yeah. means you need to roll a d6 Ooh. to see if you inflicted a wound. Let me roll another one and see if I can roll a three now. That's a six. You, my friend, just inflicted a moderate wound. Good job. Or a moderate injury. Uh, go ahead and roll me a percentile. Wait, who did you do that on? The orc. Hell yeah. yeah. He can't do shit. Yeah. Couldn't parry it if you wanted to. So you but, and I still have peril conditions, uh, 36. don't we, uh, I think so, yeah. I think I'm, uh, Hyper yeah. extended its elbow. Not... Until fully recuperated, I mean, it must... Oh, Alright guys, we got to cut down on some of the cross chatter. Until fully recuperated, you must flip all results to fail all actions in combat that rely on ranged weapons. Okay. It doesn't okay. actually that doesn't do help anything. Us anything. It doesn't. Okay. You tried. Well, you can't attempt to throw his weapon or anything. Like that. That's... Yeah. True. Uh, Tyler? Oh, hey. So there's a very fucked up goblin in front of me still. There's a very fucked up goblin. There's in front also of his friend of the not so fucked up goblin. There is a me. friend who is uninjured. I'm going to. And the orc. Um... Oh, that's. Dan, that took him to lightly. So he's got three more hits mm -hmm. until dead. Okay. I'm sorry, four more. Dirk and Jill for you to kill still the counts. goblin. I'm I'm gonna kill that one goblin. I okay. don't know why I'm looking at the action sheet so confused, but yeah, I'm gonna try and kill that one goblin. Uh, does a fifteen hit? Well, does yeah, it? As long as it's under your combat. Yes. yes. Wildly hits. Yeah, <laughs> I assume it did. Uh, and then roll a d6. Roll a d6 for damage. Uh, add one. Add your CB. Uh, plus one plus my combat bonus, so five. Uh. That slays. I slays the thing. That you goblin. It dirt. You finish bashing in that goblin skull as it collapses dead on the ground. Tyler got our first spy hander kill. What? Yeah, yeah nice. you did. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. That's fantastic. Jake. Um, hold wait, on. He's got oh, wait, he's got AP I'm sorry. Um, so you got two I can AP only left. make one attack a turn though, right? Yes. I'm going to maneuver... Okay. With my last two AP. <clears throat> which doesn't really help me any, but whatever. Okay. I just well, feel like doing it, it moves you out of uh, opportunity attack range. Mm -hmm. It's like shift in fourth edition. Jake! Why don't you hustle over to me? Because I use my first AP to attack, so. Just for fun, I'm going to try to jump up and choke this orc. Ooh, you're oh, going to do okay, these perilous stunts. Choke? Oh, yes. All right. Ooh. 
bone saws ready. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's see. Oh, man. That is... Uh-oh. That's not going to hit. That's wildly oh, bad, isn't dear. it? What'd you get? 99. Oh, that's a critical failure, my friend. Oh, can't, boy. Can you... Wildly bad. Oh, wait, you, you can't. can't flip yeah. critical failures. Ooh. Can, can you, Even if he could, it would still be a fail, yeah, critical failure. You're not allowed to... Um, you're you're, you're oh, no. fumbling right. trying to get your arm uh, around this thing's neck. No, I mean, I was talking about re-rolling it. If he could use a point to re-roll it. <laughs> no. Oh, no you're oh, fumbling to get your arm around this thing's neck. You accidentally wipe all the sand out of its eyes. You bitch. Damn. Then Alex's character threw in it. Uh, it is now that orc's turn. Oh boy! He's gonna say thanks, and he is very angry at you. <laughs> oh boy! Appreciative, but also and angry. He <laughs> comes at you with the big chopper, uh, but he fails. So I'm gonna burn one of my misfortune points uh, to so reroll. That's, that's oh. the mechanic we use them, so you can use them. Yep. Mm-hmm. He connects. You gonna parry? No. <laughs> <laughs> ninety. I thought about it, but I'm I... done with this guy. <laughs> That's I twice tried. it hit ninety. I tried. Save that for uh, when you're inflicting. That's wounds. seven damage. Rough. What does that do to you? Uh, that brings me d- seven damage. You say? Yep. That brings me down to moderate. Uh, that is going to be because it goes. Do we have our first? Is why you're dead? <laughs> no. Have you What's your damage, damage threshold? Uh, seven, thirteen, nine, and twenty-five. So this it hits your seven, so it does move you down a step. Uh, this goes past my thirteen, so. Oh, how much did I say no. it did? It's not. It's cum- it's it's not it resets every time. Okay. It's not yeah. cumulative. Yeah, right. but it's a second wound. It's per hit. Yeah. Per hit. Yeah. So it just moves you one step down. Yeah, moderate wounded. So. That is a six, though. Oh no. Oh. Oh, that's bad. Forty-nine. Jammed finger. <laughs> he hit you, and you tried to block it, and ended up jamming your finger in the process. Until you heal this, you immediately drop whatever you're holding. Aww. Until fully recuperated, you must flip the results to fail all melee weapon attacks with your primary hand. My pointed stick. No. Oh. Oh. oh boy. Joe, oh, no. I don't like any of that. <laughs> that's my that's fucked. That's so um, <laughs> hang on a second. It used one AP to attack you with its big axe, and then it's going to just fucking hardcore, just roar in your face in an attempt to intimidate you. It does litany of hatred. Uh, it fails, though. No worries. Now it's your turn, Joe. Alright. Uh, it does bank its last AP. Um, want to charge him and attack him again. Okay. Ooh, 15. Okay. So I think that hits. Uh, and you're attacking with your threshing mail? Yeah, two-handed again. He's going to try and parry that. Okay. No. Okay. Turn to two again. Uh, so it deals eight damage again. That's enough to bump him a track. That is yeah. enough to bump him down to uh, seriously wounded. Oh, again Roll a there. six. A good two d six. Yes. Uh, no, his damage was a d six. This is to see if it takes a, a wound. Oh, if. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I, no, I thought, I thought it was... Mine says 2d6 for serious and wounded. Yeah, but he's using a threshing flail, which can't inflict serious wounds. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. Well, maybe I'm not doing it right. Yeah, but he can't roll. do grievous. So, you actually, you're right. Jake, you're right. You do need... I don't really, I don't fucking know. Roll 2d6. Either of those sixes? No. Okay. Chris? Oh, anything else on your turn, Joe? Um, you use two to charge yeah, and one to that's attack. My whole thing. Okay, Chris. Um, I shall now drown out the sounds. Oh shit! Of uh, oh shit! <laughs> of uh, you what's know, your sword range play on that and flails? It is uh, three plus PB, and my PB Pleasure is bonus? 
Yes. Yeah. <laughs> three plus yeah. pleasure well, bonus. The pleasure of, oh, no. of My shooting My pleasure them. bonus is four. Ooh. So, so seven yards. Seven yards. He should be within range then. Yeah. I'm going to wildly reveal my location with the muzzle flash of a flint Wild pistol. card, bitches! He's gonna probably say <laughs> as he jumps right. up. So roll that attack. A uh, nice thing about firearms is they cannot be dodged. Uh, 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 uh. Is it a routine Think. attack form? Or is yeah, I'm just keeping everything routine right now. This is simple, so... It's your combat. If it's simple ranged. Yeah. It's combat. It's a routine, though, so you get a ton of bonus or whatever. Uh, oh. No, I'm sorry. It's going to be the standard. Oh, standard. So no, okay. no bonuses. I was thinking the wrong thing. So it's standard. There's no sort of plus on it, I suppose. Mm -mm. Nope. No, unless you took aim so, first. So now I'm going to uh, spin my lives and reroll it. All right. There you go. Don't let it just be me. Nice. Okay. Is that a hit? That is a hit. All right. That was worth it. That damage. Hell me. What is the damage? Three million. Be a D six plus, I presume your CB. Um, yeah. Like I said, three million. Three million damage. Here it comes. Boom. Oh, that's a that six. Oh shit! Damage. <laughs> I told you guys. Doing it. That's a one, All right. which also makes my gun explode. Oh. Okay. <laughs> what? Seven. It's a volatile weapon. Makes the gun in your hand or explode? It's, uh, yeah. Not volatile. volatile. When yeah. you critically fail an attack action... No, it's a gunpowder weapon is what make it. what's making it do that. Weapons of this quality can be loaded and fired while standing in an engagement. Furtherly, cannot be dodged. Finally, they explode on a face of one or six. Okay, so you're at seven. Roll that d6 again. Can we again. just say three million? <laughs> six. Oh, baby. Oh, Gosh, shit. <laughs> you got lucky right there. It's, it was uh, a six both before and after it slid. Oh, was it? So it's, it's at 19 right now. Good that's goodness. a one. 20. Another one. <laughs> 20 damage. All right. Five. That's a five. Ended finally. 25, 25 damage. The orc. Its head is blown to bits. <laughs> As you move up and just fucking ice <laughs> this thing right oh, in the back of the fucking head. Oh shit! I've, <laughs> I've made no noise up to this point and I've been completely hidden. You just walk up and just. <laughs> <"Bah!"> <laughs> His head just. <laughs> and the All orc. All over me. I was like, oh, like God. I planned. <laughs> <laughs> the orc drops dead with a new sunroof installed. Mm -hmm. yeah. Sorry, uh, was that explosive pockets in? And I yeah. just like. Yeah. Look to the goblin, and I'm like, "She feels lucky." <laughs> You're next in two turns. As soon as I reload, uh, it is now the goblin's turn. Yeah, I'll save my remaining action point for whatever might happen next. Uh, and the goblin runs. Aww. It burns all three of its AP. Alex, oh, I was like, "Nothing I can do." He gets a attack of opportunity on. Then, right? Oh, I get an oh. attack of opportunity. Don't, oh, yeah, don't we all? No, uh, I was the only one. Anyone close. who's in melee. Oh yeah, I'm not, I'm not to that goblin yet. Yeah, um, so go ahead and make that attack. Just a basic is it just attack. Normal attack. Okay. Yeah. And I, I didn't. Twenty nine. That's so, a hit. So. Yeah. yeah. Roll that damage. Questions. Come on, yes. explode for me. Explode for me. It's a one. So that doesn't explode. Uh, or it could still injure. Two. Him. Hold on. What's numbers are hard? Plus your bone. Thank you. Five. Uh, it does move him to lightly injured. Uh, uh, that doesn't do anything, though, does no, it? No, it doesn't. So the goblin runs. Alex, you got anything to do? I'm just going to look at you guys like, do we care? He's just going to go back to wherever, and they're probably not going to care. There's a goblin, too, so we don't give a fuck about All right, yeah. let's move out of combat. But, uh, I'll probably try and recover my two bolts. How, how huh. on fire is this... It's pretty on fire. I thought there was Unless no chance gonna... of there being people in it. Well, there wasn't when you went up. Oh, it doesn't matter because I pick up those two bodies and drag them into the fire, so I'd probably see anybody if they're in there. Okay. And so, you the, don't. The real question is, is there anything that could be salvaged out of the hut? And be uh, roll me there? a luck roll for each of your... So, high or low? Uh, let's just do low. Roll it. Roll your percentile. 
What'd you get? Not low. All right, roll higher. No, wait. Take those dice out. Oh, okay. Higher low. Uh, since the last one was high, we'll say high this time, so then it can right. roll low. Okay, that was uh, sixty-eight. All so. right, you reclaim one of your your bolts. Nice. I need to make sure I don't roll those anymore for things so, that matter. Congratulations on everyone surviving a combat. Uh, some uh, of you are injured, though. Yes. Uh, and remember, sleeping doesn't cure ha uh, stab wounds. I don't. Did anyone get stabbed? Is anyone bloody? It, it's, an, it's saying those white hander people like to do. But Jake did take an injury. Yeah, I think. How do you heal injury? Uh, you have to go find someone to heal them. Oh, here's a bandage. I need a barber. Oh. Uh, were you wearing armor? <laughs> yes. Okay, so you weren't bleeding. So at least there's that. Oh. Does it have to be like a profession or is it like a heal check? Uh, you would have to have, I'd Wait. have to look it up, but essentially you would need someone who's got some real serious did we do training. What? Did we kill the barber? Is that short? No, I no, thought no. we were friends with him. That's what I'm asking. I was like, did we kill him or not? We no, don't no, weren't we friends with him. him. <laughs> you talking about in that other town? Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. So long as I'm awake when he cuts off the correct finger, I'll be okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> so we'll take you back no, to him. Sometime. I thought he did like us. Cause yeah, he remember. likes us. No, he yeah. tried to, he, he cut the wrong, that one dude's arm off. He likes me. Yeah, that's true. We, like, that had nothing to do with that. We, so. like, busted into his back room. We really did. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. So what's the plan? Well, step one, I'm going to pull my pants up. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I was, I'm throwing bodies in the fire right now. Are we yeah. not thinking that Goblin's going to go run and, and tell them that give we... our descriptions and blow our deal with... Uh, it's a Goblin. Team? I don't know. If they didn't Wait, what's the deal with the Orc too fondly of the Goblins anyway, so... Who? Yeah, which yeah, which way did the uh, goblin run? Uh, it would have ran back the direction you just came from, so like towards that cave. Oh, I don't give a fuck about that. He's going back to the camp, and nobody's there. So, were you here for the last session? No, I oh. missed last week. Okay, well, not last week. But La you know what I mean? Yeah, two weeks. Mm -hmm. Okay, so lady, okay, orcs invaded this town. Yes, uh, Maximilian yeah. gave up all the women and the children to the orcs. And the person in charge of the orcs now is one of those women. Oh. And she wants to kill Maximilian. Not just one of those women. Oh, like, uh, are you talking about the first time that this they invaded? Yeah, first time. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. I got it. Yeah. 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 So She's now one of those women. Yeah. So now the deal is, we Maximilian's bring her Maximilian wife. and the tavern owner Not with just the one bullshit of the sword. Hold and then she leaves. So, <laughs> hold on. The plan is, we go back, we warn all the women and children to leave, and then whatever deal we make, we're in the clear. So even if they come and rans, I mean, this is what I'm suggesting, and nobody's told me no logically. Uh, even if they come and ransack the town, only the men and Maximilian and uh, Pegasus will die. Pegasus. That's a Yu-Gi-Oh joke. Okay. <laughs> oh, who? Jake, you took an injury. Yes. Yeah. But it turns uh, out the woman that's three the is uh, three Maximilian's ex-wife. Ah. And daughter. Yeah. So that's who mother and cat. Katrina are? Mm. Yes. Yep. Okay. Katrina. Yep. She just wants to kill Maximilian and Horst. The bar, right. the tavern owner. So I, remember, I remember Horst. Yeah. Jake, so for you to move to get rid of that injury, you have to find someone who with the skill test, they have to expend some medicine and they have to pass a skill check and they'll remove your injury. Right. From there... You can get another skill test done to move you up the damage track. So, you gotta find a doctor. Or you don't heal. Yeah. That's intense. Yeah. Uh, you know, I think I had proficiency on that. Uh, proficiency on medicine? No, no, not medicine. On that stealth check at the beginning. That's fine. We're way but past it. But it doesn't that. matter. It doesn't matter anymore. Alright, guys, so what's going on? Uh, I think we're going to the town. Mm hmm. After we throw the body, is there anything that can be salvaged from the burning cabin? No, nothing. No. It's it's pretty far. You might have the bodies in there. Oh no, I'm not. Um, check do your we have like what? Huh? Nah, I'll let you do that. Um, do we have like five minutes to like dig the uh, uh, graves real quick? Yes, uh, you guys are all gonna help me dig two graves real quick. Okay, you're gonna yeah, need go to for give it. Knock me... yourselves out. You're gonna help me do it, so we can do it quickly. Boy, I sure love to help. So you when I lie and say that it was self-defense, and it looks like one hand. nice, yeah, 
Yeah. No. You can dig with one hand. Nope. It's fine. You, you got it. I All believe right. in you. I remember right. that. <laughs> You're little screen do... pops up in the corner. <laughs> Dirty yeah. don't remember that. <laughs> You're going to need to do an athletics check to make sure you can actually dig this quickly. Are there any uh, shovels left unburnt outside of the hut? Yeah, I'll say there's a little shed that's got a handful of shovels in it. Okay. Uh, Why are we digging it? No, so no. when I lie and say that it was self-defense, and that I was kind enough to even bury them, this was not just some brutal murder. And since you're having to dig this fast, I'm going to call it a challenging check. Oh, shit. So you're, you're, essentially you're going to treat your score like it's ten less than what it is. Mm. Are we all going to check to see how fast each of us Who's, digs? Is anyone going to dig with Alex? I'll dig yeah, with I'll Alex. Dig. Uh, we'll all suffer. Yeah. Eight? <laughs> Did you say eight? I got an eight. All right. Who else is digging? Me. Roll. I'm digging. I got 39. Okay. Astro? Uh, what? Is Braun athletics. Someone. It's Braun. Braun uh, Athletics. Yeah. Oh, okay. Jake, you weren't digging. No. Tyler, were you digging? I got a, I got a 74. Uh, you do not contribute to the help of the digging. As is tradition. And you actually kind of strain yourself a little bit and you take oh, four peril. Boo. Yeah. I got a 43 and my bronze 46. So. That doesn't do anything. It doesn't. It may not. Joe? Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't. Uh, I, got with the I rolled a 39 and I got, and I had to get 37. Oh, with it, uh, you take nine peril. It's challenging for me, too, right? Yeah. Challenging for everybody. Yeah, no, I didn't. I got a 43 out of 57. Seven peril. Man, you guys peril resets out of uh, sleeping, 36. right? Did you, uh, did you pass, Chris? You can only go up to imperil, no. I think, after resting, and then you have to take something to go no, on him. that is false. No, not, with, with, um, if you are not sleeping oh, somewhere safe, safe, place, safe place. you can only move up to one That's below. Right. If you're sleeping okay. somewhere safe, you can, with rest, it completely resets. You said seven peril? I tried to yes. lie to everybody, like I normally do. No uh, anyway, Alex, you do succeed in getting it dug, so even though you're an ally, <laughs> except for Dan. Mm -hmm. uh, don't really contribute a whole. We much. decided that it's time to strike. So wait, there's two of them. Yeah, so we got two this. graves, then I would yeah. assume. Okay. Yeah. You get your job done mm -hmm. in the time frame that you set out to do it. I even placed like their weapons on top of the graves. And one of the holes was pretty small for the goblin. So. Mm -hmm. And I, I mean, the orc was missing a head, so. I'm feeling pretty terrible. I'm probably gonna hold off on anything stressful until it's actually time to fight. Well, yeah. hopefully there won't be time to fight. Hopefully. All right. I feel pretty good. You guys must suck. <laughs> <laughs> it is getting close to dusk. I put more sand in my pocket. <laughs> that is a great thing. I moment. feel emotionally wounded, and I moved to <laughs> incapacitate. <laughs> oh, <laughs> All right. So shall we We're keep moving? Out of time. Yeah, yeah I know. We, we absolutely have to get there, because the lady said the orcs are going to get there at night, so... Mm. Yeah, we let's, can't fuck around. Let's hustle on. You guys on. hustle on to town? Mm -hmm. yeah. She, yeah. Didn't she say we have till midnight to burn no, the heads? No, she had, had till dark. Oh. Yeah, which oh. is basically now. You got you got predictably maybe like 45 minutes. Do the hustle. I'm, I'm heading straight to the tavern. Okay. We're going to wrap our break right there. So when we come back, we'll go ahead and... We can maybe have a bit of discussion on break about... We'll pick strategy. up... As you guys reach the town. Um, so, if you're watching on YouTube, give us a few days. We'll have another episode of this out. If you're watching on Twitch, give us a handful of minutes. We'll be right back. Um, and as always, until we see you next time, start fires, do drugs, tip your bartenders. Deuces.